Representing Rio de Janeiro, the UFC flyweight champion Alessandro Pantoja. He is an absolute animal. Why are you coming at the king? Why are you coming at the guy? He has submission skills. He has striking skills. He mixes things up spectacularly. I'm the champion right here. Perth, Western Australia. Steve Ursag has arrived. Oh! I'm just holding back to still so why you me? Steve Ursek, his winning streak is now 11, and the big fights are going to come for that man. And he believes he can walk away with the flyweight title. Why you coming at the king? Why you coming at the guy? Pantoja is a hunter. The best 125 pound fighter in the world. Steve Ursek, this man is very well rounded. He can do it all at a world class level. The man's an absolute living legend. He has a country behind him. They love this guy. Jonathan Martinez. Six wins in a row. Multiple TKOs. This man is so dangerous. UFC live from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. What a fight. Pantoja versus Steve Ursig. Steve Ursig is one of the most exciting up-and-coming guys. He is so skillful. He's so well-rounded and so intelligent inside the octagon. And what a meteoric rise to a shot at the title. Almost undeniable just based on a few performances yeah. inside the octagon. But Pantoja is an animal. He is so good and so experienced. What a fight that is. And the return of the King of Rio. Jonathan Martinez gets to face Jose Aldo in Brazil. Nobody wants to do that, but Martinez steps up. What a phenomenal card, and I can't wait for that main event. That title fight is absolutely outstanding. And it all goes down May 4th as the UFC returns to Rio de Janeiro for UFC 301 Pantoja in defense against Ursek in the main event. Also, as Joe mentioned, the king of Rio, Jose Aldo, returns against Jonathan Martinez. You can buy UFC 301 now. Get a special offer, $10 off, if you buy it before April 29th at ESPNplus.com slash UFC 301. All right, these strawweight rankings.